What's going on everybody? It's Zach Michael here today. We are gonna be making a beat using Electra X. It's honestly a plugin I use a lot, but today we're gonna go ahead and use it exclusively. And we're just gonna load up a Roy Major Bank. Try to find a nice sound. And we're gonna use this pluck. Now, if you guys do enjoy, make sure to leave a like and subscribe and check out lizardrecords.net. Let's make something in B minor we got this little plucky sound we're just going to kind of build out some chords here like that now we're going to duplicate these and arpeggiate them and we're going to go back to the default arpeggio mode like that and just Do stuff like that. And then we're going to change this note in the chord. And now here I want to do the same, but only on the second half. So we're going to deselect those. And we're just going to pitch this to like that. We're going to lower that right there now next I want to load up another Electra we're gonna try to just layer some sounds Electra is very ambient sounding presets most of the time which is good for the type of beats that I make but if you want to make stuff sound more full or have a lot more stuff you want to go ahead and just layer everything It's really all we need melodically. Do a little synth lead. And just like that, we have a pretty solid melody. Let's do some drums on this. And we're going to go ahead and just cut some hi-hat rolls into the hi-hat so it's not just a two-step. I'll lower the velocity on that. for a very distorted 808 so i'm going to use this one here called emotional times this one here very very distorted 808 let's simplify this a bit let's do something like that instead Just like that. Then we're gonna layer a kick. So we're just gonna copy this over and then click Alt K. Honestly, it's pretty solid. Let's just mix these drums a bit. Mostly just levels. All these sounds are from my kids, so I already know what they sound like. So all I really gotta do is level them. And then now we're on to arrangement. So we got three layers of Electro, but it's about to become four because I want a section without this ARP. So it'll just be these little chords there of the initial pluck, which don't sound too full, but when we layer them with the bell, 
they got like a full sound of it and the texture on them is solid. So let's just get started here. Get Usually I do a four bar intro, but today we're gonna change it up. We're gonna have a bit of like, I guess a pre-hook technically. So it's gonna sound like this. Get the camera is set. Little sound, and then we're gonna bring in that noise here. Just let that kind of rock out. So this will be your hook. I'm gonna drop in the verse with just the chords here. The kick. duplicate that over and that's going to be the arrangement and then for the outro we'll have the chords going with a little lead melody and we're going to pull in the high arp for the second half we're just going to go from these chords then having the high arp when all of the drum sounds come in. A little volume automation. And just like that, we have a beat made with Electra X. So if you guys enjoy, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, check out LizardRecords.net. Thanks for watching. Head on over to ElizabethRecords.net if you'd like to support me. You can purchase VST expansion banks, drum kits, loop kits, and mini kits that'll level up your production there.